Let's go to the metal lane. Yeah, that's enough of that. You know the blood is not good between these two teams. Oh, poor oh, 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 you knew Joey was going to stir it up a little Didn't bit. You say that oh, you Joey? knew it. You knew it. Curry Rose. Rose. Tried you, Fired Joey. Up. Tight ends are even getting in there. Joey like that. Oh, wow. Too important, isn't it? This game was tied at three in the third quarter, but don't let that scoreboard fool you. It wouldn't stay that way for long. Thomas Jones with an 11-yard gain. Paul Pasqualoni watching Jay Feely trot out for a 55-yard field goal attempt, and it is good. Down the middle. Jets are on top. 6-3 for Rex Ryan's crew. He loves it. Uh-oh. Until they kicked off. Yeah, we only show you this for one or two reasons. Ted Ginn from the end zone. It is a 100-yard return coming off a week in which he was benched during practice. Former old Dolphins were bagging on Ginn in the press. And he's got the Dolphins on top, 10-6. Next possession for the Jets. Sean Green strips. Jason Taylor picks it up. And Rex Ryan cannot believe it. A kickoff return and a defensive return has his team down 17-6. And in the ensuing possession, Devon Bess muffs the punt. Tony Sperano's now not happy with his special teams. He would be later. Five plays later, oh, Mark nice. Sanchez. Oh, wow. I, hey. I would say he was hot dogging, but 17-13, the Dolphins on top. Anymore. Nobody saw Sanchez. Nice sell. Okay, well done. That's a good play call. Great play call. But the Jets have to kick off. And Mike Westhoff saying, look, uh -oh. this is what you do when Ted Ginn gets the ball. You need to cover. And it doesn't work. See, this normally doesn't happen. See, I missed one, missed two. Never. Miss. Oh, he's gone. He's over. Because yeah. he can fly. The first player in NFL history with two kickoff returns of 100 yards or more in the same game, Ted Ginn Jr. Dolphins on top 24-13, but this game was not done by a long shot. Oh, look at this play. Uh, now, this is what he's great at now. He, he, he gets People get on him about playing wide receiver, but he's a great return. Man. Jets next possession, first play of Jericho Cotchery. 53-yard gain, longest pass play of Sanchez's young career. Good job by Mark, extending the play and creating and finding the open man. Two plays later, Sanchez, Braylon Edwards. Nice. Get it in! The ball comes loose, but the official says that Braylon had crossed the goal line before it comes loose. Jets make it a one-possession game again. He's a strong man. He's going to pull both of these guys over the goal line with him. Five-point game. Jets go for two. Don't get it. Fourth quarter we go. Charles Dolphins next possession. Two. Well, it's a third quarter. Third and two. Kid. Ronnie Brown, Wildcat, was one of the first positive plays that the Wildcat had against the Jets on this day. The Jets had bottled it up until that point. Four plays later, Chad Henning and Vaughn Bess appears to fumble, but to be honest, the, the replay wasn't called up in the uh, production truck fast enough. The Dolphins that get... was a fumble. The Dolphins got the playoff before the, the replay was even shown on television, so wow. the Jets didn't challenge it, and it paid off for the Dolphins. And he does best. He throws very well on the run. Joey Hayness makes it a 30-19 game. Dolphins go for two. Don't get it. Jets next possession. Sanchez to Braylon Edwards over the middle, 20 yards. Two plays later. Remember, this was a 3-3 game at the half. Sanchez to Dustin Keller. Touchdown, Jets. Oh, great catch. catch. Great oh, banger shoot. too, kid. And a great route. Jets go for two now. Jets go for two to try to make it a one field goal game. And Sanchez converts to Wallace Wright, but there's a flag on the play. Jets called for an illegal shift. Mm. Well, let's do it again. Rex Ryan cannot uh. believe it. He thought he had it within one field goal. Now it's a two-pointer from the seven, and Sanchez doesn't convert. 30 to 25, that would rear its ugly head for the Jets later on. Next possession, 303 left in the game. Sanchez to Jericho Cotchery. 12 yards first down. Two plays later, second attempt from Miami, 39. Thomas Jones rushing up the middle. These are the two best rushing teams in the National Football League. Four plays later, it's fourth and ten. Last chance saloon for the Jets and Sanchez. Can't find anybody until he throws it up for Dustin. Keller makes a play. Oh, what a play. What a play. Way to keep that play alive. Way to find the receiver and give him an opportunity 
to make a play that's the killer. Makes so over play. the top of the linebacker, good trajectory on the ball, excellent catch. Dustin Tuck, you might say. Dustin Tuck. Three plays later, Sanchez oh. is sacked, though, by Randy Starks, who had a big game for the Dolphins. It's fourth down again. Sanchez trying to extend the play again. This time, though, it doesn't work. And the Dolphins hold on to sweep the Jets. First time that's happened since 2003. And the Dolphins resurrect their season again. The Jets had two chances to put a nail in the Dolphins' coffin. One nail, perhaps not the final one. But Ted Ginn and the Dolphins come off the mat again to sweep the Jets. A very bitter pill for Rex Ryan to swallow.